Hi everybody, welcome back to Hoops and Hops with Jesus YouTube channel. Hope you are welcome. So today's video, we're doing a Q&A. My family wrote down these questions. All these questions, I do not know what any of them are. So, we're gonna do that. But first, uh, three days ago, every single day since three days ago, we've had Kyrie's no pasture. So I'm gonna insert a clip now, <clears throat> so you guys can see that. So, now we're back. We're gonna get straight into this q and I'm pretty sure we have 32 questions. The first question is, do you have... <laughs> oh my. Um, yeah, we'll say no to this question. Do you have a girlfriend? No, I do not. We're going to shred it right now because we don't care about that. Okay, <clears throat> now we're going to get into the real stuff. Why do you love riding horses? Well, the reason I love riding horses, <clears throat> it's because, well, my sister got me into it. And ever since then, I've just loved them. And I've been loving riding horses. I just love horses and I love riding them. Next question. What are the differences in riding skills between you and your sister? Um, well, my sister, she has a thoroughbred, <clears throat> so she can be jumping higher. She's been jumping longer, riding horses longer. And she's went to lessons, and I've only went to one lesson. She's went to many lessons. So, yeah, that's mainly the difference. Next question is, what type of hay is your favorite to feed your horse? My favorite type of hay is alfalfa grass mix. She loves that stuff. And also, it's so sweet and yummy. I want to eat it. One time I ate it and I choked. Hmm. List. So this is my sister's. List five pros of starlight and honeybee. Five pros of starlight, which is my sister's. She can jump really high. She has tons of potential um she's very cute and sweet and um i love her color and markings and also whenever she can and also she's gonna be a really good mom now honeybee five pros of honeybee she's cute she's sweet she's gonna be a really good mom awesome mother she has some good potential in the hunter jumper wing no, not, not as good as Starlight, but she still has some pretty good potential. And then I think that was five. <clears throat> Next question is, do you like cats or dogs better? I have to go with dogs, but I really do like both of them. For dogs, I like how you can play with them, and all dog kind of talks to us sometimes, so that's pretty cool. Next question is, With the cold air of the season upon us, how much more work are your chores? Well, since it's cold, everything gets full, so it's cold though, we have to put more gear on. So I'd say it takes probably more than, I'd say it takes 15 minutes more longer with the cold. When I was doing goats, so it took like 15 minutes too. So it's way harder with the cold here. Next question is, what is your favorite horse discipline? Well, my favorite horse discipline now is show jumping. So this is what happened. So I, I did bell racing and like western and then I did hunter jumpers and now I'm doing show jumping across country and show jumping across country is by far my favorite. And I do not think I'll ever change from loving that so much. Next question is, Oh, my dad and my sister wrote down my same, the same question. What is your favorite discipline? What is your favorite discipline? So, um, yeah, we're just gonna skip that one. The next one is, what is your favorite singer? 
Rolling Dago, still rolling stones. Yes, be just keep rolling, rolling. You're still rolling stones. That is by far my favorite singer. Next question is, fall on the ground. What do you like, like the best? Cross country, dressage, or show jumping? Cross country, show jumping, and then dressage. The reason I like cross country is because you just get a gallop on the countryside, doing all different kinds of jumps. Just you and your horse. Describe my dream horse. My dream horse would be 16-2 to 16-3 hand thoroughbred. It could be an OTTB or just a TB. Um, if you don't know what that means, off the track thoroughbred or just thoroughbred. Um, I want it to be, have the potential to jump like five foot. My sister's horse definitely has that potential. Um, I like it to be a bay, gray, or dun. Now, duns are really rare in thoroughbreds usually. I have a dun, but they're really rare. And <clears throat> if it was a bay, I wanted it to have all white socks. If it was gray, I wanted to have white socks and be a darker gray. And also, if it was a bay, I wanted to um, have a star and a place. And then for a dun, I wanted to have tiger stripes. Next question is. What is your favorite movie? I have, well, my two favorite movies, they're like literally tied, Flicka, all the Flicka series, and then Secretariat. I love those two movies, and those are probably my favorite movies. My next one is, do you, do you handle your host differently in spring? Yes, in spring, my host is usually wheeling and bolting, Lately, when I rode her before we got all this snow, which is outside right now. Oh, right there. <laughs> um, yeah, she should be wearing and bolting and bucking. So yeah, I definitely handle her different in winter and spring. Next question is, <clears throat> let me get it here. What are the pros and cons of your current horse? Ha ha. Um, the cons are, I would like to be able to jump a little higher. I want it to be a little bit younger, but I can't change that. Um, the pros are, she's really sane, good trailers. She can definitely do a three day event, which I want to do. And she's really good for a beginner, except for in the winter and spring when she wears. So those are the pros and cons. Next question is, my bowl's getting pretty low here. Next question is, what are some YouTube channels you follow. You should go check these out. I follow follow Holly Lenahan, Day by Day Vlogs, Justina Pomo, um, Alfiki Event Ponies, Rob the Cobb, and Stephanie Prince, Stephanie Murado, or Moto, whatever the last name is. Um, Alfiki Event's my favorite. So if you like Alfiki Event, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe button, hit the notification bell if you don't miss any of our videos. Next question is, describe my riding journey. So, my riding journey, it hasn't been the easiest. Um, so, first I started on a lead line. Just my mom and my dad leading me through the trail. And then I started trotting and cantering and doing all that. And I started getting into like, Pulls, bells, and that because that's what my sister and my mom were doing. And then I did that for like about a year, I would say. And then my sister moved to show jumping, and then she started going to our instructor. And um, <clears throat> then my mom started doing that a little bit, and I'm not she wasn't quite fully into it. And then she really started loving it too, and my sister really loved it. So they were both in it, and I was just stuck in the western. So then, about when a year went by, so that was my first year in riding, I started like going into jumping and all that stuff. And then I went to some hunter jumper shows. And then this year, I started going to um, some show jumping and cross country and mini events and stuff. And that's what I'm gonna stay into. So that's basically my <clears throat> riding journey. Next question is, what do you want to do for your future career? 
Well, I'd love to have a YouTube channel. <clears throat> like, keep with this YouTube channel and do that. I like to be an instructor, compete in like some, oops, some three star events maybe. And I'd want to do that. Next question is, uh, what is your favorite lighting memory? Hmm. Moment of silence. <laughs> um, I don't really have a favorite. I mean, I feel so many. It's just so hard. When we went horse camping, that was really fun. Our first ever time going to the state fair was really fun. Yeah. And then cross country schooling was really fun. So those were probably my favorites. Some of my favorites. We have two more questions. Describe your favorite. What the heck? My my dad and my sister. I mean, oh, my dad and my sister think alike. My sister put, what is your favorite? Describe your favorite writing memory. And my dad put, describe your favorite writing memory. That's two questions that are the same. Okay, next question is, what are your show plans in 2021? Well, I want to go to some mini events. I want to go to some mini events and do show jumping and I want to go to some overnight shows. I want to go to some lessons and those are my show plans for 2021. So it looks like that is all of my questions. Now I'm going to tell one that my brother did. It's on the ground right here. I never did. It says do <laughs> okay no i'm not gonna read this one this one should just get torn up it's, do you have a girlfriend have you ever kissed a girlfriend no i have not how dare you say that about me my brother like cuckoo no he's not but so thank you for watching give this video a big thumbs up man please subscribe down below hit that notification bell if you miss any of our videos what's that noise yeah, it's pretty noisy in here. But, this is my grandma's dog. Do you want to see her? This is her. I mean, isn't she just darling? And that's my brother and sister when they were young. I know, but they're just darling. <laughs> and that's my grandma outside. I know, isn't it just darling? I know, and that's like all of our memories up there. Isn't it just darling? I know, it is. I know. Are you guys getting bored of this? Oh, you are. I'm not. Ha, bye. I forgot to mention, my next video is going to be a day in my life if the weather permits it. I'm going to add on a picture of the cake I made. Coming up like three, two, one. Valentine's Day.